Welcome to this video on CSB Bank India, one of the oldest and most resilient private sector banks in India. Let's see how it was founded, how it survived various challenges and crises, and how it transformed into a profitable and modern bank. CSB Bank was established in 1920 as the Catholic Syrian Bank Limited at Thrissur in Kerala by a group of prominent businessmen who wanted to serve the local community, especially the Syrian Christian population. The bank grew steadily and expanded its network across Kerala and other states. In 1969, it became a scheduled bank and achieved scheduled bank, a class status by 1975. The bank also diversified its products and services to cater to various segments of customers, such as agriculture, MSMEs, education, and housing. However, the bank also faced several challenges and difficulties in its long history. It had to cope with the impact of World War II, India's independence, nationalization of banks, privatization of nationalized banks, liberalization of the economy, global financial crisis, demonetization, and COVID-19 pandemic. It also suffered from lack of capital, high NPAs, low profitability, outdated technology, and employee unrest. The turning point for the bank came in 2016 when FIH Mauritius Investments Limited, a Fairfax Group company, acquired 51% stake in the bank for 1,208 crore rupees. This was the first time that a foreign investor got a controlling stake in a private bank in India after the RBI tweaked the ownership guidelines for private sector banks. The new promoter infused fresh capital into the bank and helped it achieve scale and growth. The bank also underwent a major transformation under the leadership of former CEO CVR Rajendran and interim MD and CEO Prale Mandal. The bank rebranded itself as CSB Bank Limited in 2019 and went public on December 4, 2019 by listing its shares on BSE and NSE. The bank also revamped its business strategy, improved its asset quality, enhanced its digital capabilities, diversified its revenue streams, and strengthened its governance and risk management. As a result of these initiatives, the bank turned profitable in 2020 after several years of losses. The bank reported a profit after tax of 13 crore rupees in FY20 and 218 crore rupees in FRI21. The bank also improved its capital adequacy ratio to 22%, which is well above the regulatory requirement. The bank also increased its customer base to nearly 1.3 million people and its branch network to over 560 branches and more than 390 ATMs across India. Today, CSB Bank is one of the leading private sector banks in India with a strong presence in Kerala, Tamil Nadu, Maharashtra and Karnataka. It offers a wide range of banking services and products to meet personal and business needs. It also sponsors Kerala-based I-League club Gokulam Kerala FC. CSB Bank is an inspiring example of how an old and traditional bank can reinvent itself and become a young and dynamic bank with the help of a visionary promoter and a dedicated team. CSB Bank is truly 100 years too young. But what makes CSB Bank an attractive investment option for you? Here are some reasons why you should consider investing in CSB Bank. CSB Bank has a strong brand value and customer loyalty in its core markets. It has been serving its customers for over a century with trust and integrity. CSB Bank has a diversified portfolio of loans that caters to various segments of customers. It has a focus on gold loans, which are secured by collateral and have low delinquency rates. It also has a Nietzsche presence in SME loans, retail loans, agriculture loans, education loans and housing loans. CSB Bank has improved its asset quality significantly over the years. It has reduced its gross NPAs from 7.25% in FY18 to 3.51% in FRI21. It has also increased its provision coverage ratio from 58% in FY18 to 86% in FRI21. 
CSB Bank has enhanced its digital capabilities to provide seamless and convenient banking services to its customers. It has launched various digital products such as CSB Insta Account, a fully digital savings account, CSB A Auction, an online platform for auctioning gold ornaments, CSB UPI, a unified payment interface, CSB Mobile Banking, a mobile app for banking transactions, CSB Net Banking, an internet banking platform, and CSB Cards, debit cards with various features. CSB Bank has delivered consistent growth in its revenues and profits over the years. It has increased its total income from 16.76 billion rupees in FY19 to 27.36 billion rupees in free 21. It has also increased its net profit from minus 1.97 billion rupees in FY19 to 2.18 billion rupees in free 21. CSB Bank has rewarded its shareholders with attractive returns on their investments. The bank's share price has increased from 178 rupees on December 4, 2019, the listing date, to 290 rupees on May 29, 2023, the current date. This represents a gain of over 62% in less than four years. CSB Bank has a strong promoter backing from Fairfax Group Company which holds 51% stake in the bank. Fairfax Group Company is led by Prem Watser, who is known as the Warren Buffett of Canada for his value investing style. Fairfax Group Company has invested in various successful companies such as ICICI Lombard General Insurance Company Limited, NS, ICIL, Thomas Cook India Limited, NS, Tom, Quest Corp Limited, NS, Quest, and National Collateral Management Services Limited NCML. These are some of the reasons why you should consider investing in CSB Bank India. However, before investing, you should do your own research and analysis based on your risk appetite and financial goals. Thank you for watching this video. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more interesting videos on banking and finance.